So it's Canada and New Zealand in this next batch of women's internationals here at the Oceania Sevens Championship. The Black Ferns against Canada women. Canada went down earlier to Japan and also have lost to Australia at this tournament. So we'll be looking to register a win here against New Zealand who also went down to the Aussies earlier today. A referee from Perth, Western Australia is Tyler Miller. Big Lord of the Rings fan. Do you ever find yourself chatting to um, it? One, two, three, four, five, six. You good? So good to go. New Zealand to get us underway in this match. <laughs> Wilson puts it to the left and a big on air collision. Good advantage for a knock on, I believe, to Canada. Run straight into traffic. Here comes the women in red, just needs a good bounce. That's good work over the ball by New Zealand. It's got nothing really happening on the left side, but Pusia makes an effort anyway. Such a strong athlete. A big welcome to everyone tuning in in Canada as well who might be getting up. I assume it's the middle of the night to watch friends and family play. It's Canada get over the halfway. Atkins gets the offload away and this is dangerous from the Canadian women. Brought to ground inside the 22. Slow ball coming for Canada, but it does come eventually. They need to go right, find Lucan. Who puts the wheels on, needs someone on the inside. Canada causing all sorts of defensive headaches at the moment. Canada. Oh no. A drop ball with nothing but the line in front. Scrum. Looking here, drawing in, drawing in a couple of players, and then Ella yeah. O'Regan no. won't be putting that one on the highlights no. reel. Just come closer, ladies. Mark's here. Thank you. Yep. I got left. Hold, who's, who's with you left? Crouch. Bind. They're coming this way. Set. Yeah, they're coming this way, Kaylee. I got. Um, but New Zealand, the pressure from the scrum, Canada put on a big shove. Now there's a slight chance of cracking through the Canadian defence. Cassita comes in and that's brilliant from New Zealand. They won't catch her. New Zealand shot the ball down and register the first points of this match. Just see here the wheels of sail to create the space. <laughs> Kick is not successful. So New Zealand lead five points to zero against Canada. Restart. He's going to kick it high. Well, 
Well taken. Tacos! Eventually the ball gets to ground. Yeah, just coming around the gate. A little offload there, no look pass, and the netball pass over the top has worked pretty well. And away they go, Canada. Emma Chown puts the wheels on and goes for the tr first try for the North Americans. So five all kick to come. Just having a yep. look at this replay and whoa. There were spiders all over her. Such fierce determination to get to the line. Canada from point blank range. Get the points. So New Zealand five, Canada seven. Double check the bounce on the ball. Kick is going out. Free kick. <laughs> so New Zealand will get a crack from the halfway. Over the top they go. And that's a high, high tackle. tackle. Where you are. Got to come back. Refereed by Where it was. Isla Miller. Hi. Hailing from Perth in WA. Which is Western Australia for our international audience. New Zealand. Got numbers if they can move the ball. Such good at spatial awareness, New Zealand. And I think that's Sale. Just tried to float on through. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant stuff from New Zealand. We'll have the last say of the half, you'd think. Tanika Willison with the try. 10 points to seven, kick to come. That's half now. Is that half, Russ? Yeah. New Zealand leading at the break. 12 points to seven. Good. Thanks to all our fans texting in on the text line as well, especially those in New Zealand. Reading a few of them there from the Canterbury region. As Canada yep. get us underway. Oh, and a little knock on. Knock on. By New Zealand, it was a scrappy start. Just up, please. Thank you. So we'll have a scrum. Hold for subs. On the 40 metre line. Sub complete. New Zealand 12, yeah, cool. Canada 7. It's anyone's game at the yeah. moment. Crouch. Bind. Give her space. Stand up. Give her space so she can stand square. You must stand square at the scrum, okay? She gives you that space. Reset. Crouch. Bind. Set. Canada with the feed. And That's fine. Knock on advantage. Knock on by Canada. That's great pressure no from New Zealand. Knock on from the scrum. No advantage. Knock on from the scrum. Just forcing the error there. 
Candace Ella, oh, oh sorry, on <laughs> Alyssa Alari. Just a sec. Yeah. I'm out last kick. Crouch. Bind. Set. Ready? Good scrum by Canada, putting New Zealand under all sorts of pressure. Now the Blackfern Sevens. Try and just do something out of their own half. We know how dangerous they are from all aspects of the field. Tackle Referee assist, Miller release. spots an infringement, Tackle not assist. releasing, so Canada release. retreat 10. 12 points to seven. <laughs> New Zealand. Oh, and another little knock on. That pass just a bit ambitious. Teresa Fitzpatrick couldn't hold on to that one. Coach! Bind! Just stand up. Because you need to hold your weight before you set, to reset okay? that one. And make sure that you're not taking a step back and holding their weight too, please. Bind. Set. So Canada. Powering through the line. That's a great effort. There, I think that was Lucan again. And here comes Lucia. New Zealand looks like they've stolen this. But Canada get the penalty. They've got advantage. Don't know what to do with it. They're going backwards at a rate of knots, so they'll need to find space soon, otherwise New Zealand will be penalised. And there it is. Still anyone's ball game, 12 points to seven. We'll see ya. Out in her own. Didn't go with her troops. And that is a coach killer. So now Canada will have to defend again. There's some space there in the middle of the field for New Zealand. And there it is. The big gap opened up. And Felix Hotham will run away to score underneath the post. Excellent work there by New Zealand. We know how strong they are and capable of finding space from all over the field, and they've just demonstrated that. And that kick is successful. Hotham, just seeing there on the replay. Talented young player, the women in black. I love the little switch kick option. He's yelling, that's overcooked. Back for kick. So, Canada looked like they were getting ready for a little line out, but they'll come back for halfway. The Oceania Sevens live. New Zealand lead Canada in this women's invitational. Both these teams have qualified for Tokyo 2020. There's still plenty of qualification battles happening at the Oceania Sevens. We'll play out tomorrow here at ANZ Stadium in Suva, Canada. Looking good. Need to get the offload away, but New Zealand are there, and that's Portia Woodman. He's making a return from injury. Canada's running back into traffic through Crosley, their captain. Hold. We're just going to wait for your player. 
It's going to be your ball scrum when we restart. So we've got an injured player down and referee hey. Miller didn't want to take any ball. chances. So we'll have a scrum for the restart. No point anyone getting injured in a, not that there's any friendlies in rugby, but a little invitational. Come on, red scrum. Does Canada make a oh, not not on, sorry. last ditch few subs? 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Just come close, I'm much here. 19 points to seven. Not long left Coach. in this match. Bind. New Zealand Set. have done enough to win it. Can Canada though score? Have the last laugh of the game. An advantage for a high shot. So advantage high. Canada in possession. New Zealand in retreat. Back on the inside they go. Lucan again. She's been so strong for Canada. They try to bash their way through. This wall of black jerseys. Advantage over. Advantage is over. Again, New Zealand repel wave after wave of attack. Canada just losing that ball backwards. That was Crossley. Here comes Chown, the try scorer. Canada is not gaining any territory at the moment, but they do get the penalty. And they take it quickly. Was New Zealand back on side? It shouldn't matter though. And Canada will have the last laugh. It won't be enough to win a game. But a strong performance from the Canadians. So it's not full time yet, still a kick to come. Won't be successful, so full time. New Zealand have beaten Canada 19 points to 12. 